Hello everyone, this is WJLP's Newsbreak. I'm Veronica Dudo. President Trump is standing firm on his demands for a border wall after the second White House meeting with congressional leaders this week broke up with no apparent deal. In an impromptu Rose Garden address, the president called the meeting productive but indicated that he is not shifting on his demand for more than $5 billion in funding for a wall on the southern border, saying it is necessary for national security. The Wall Street Journal is reporting that an employee for Governor Phil Murphy has initiated a process to sue the state after she claimed she was sexually assaulted by another staff member during the 2017 gubernatorial campaign. According to the news agency, Katie Brennan filed a notice of claim on December 28th. The alleged incident occurred while Brennan was a volunteer on the Murphy campaign. She is now chief of staff at a state housing agency. For more on these stories, visit APP.com.